$1 million from the Beltrami County Board of Commissioners will go to a veteran's home in Bemidji. Over a five-year period, the board would give $700,000 from the County Development Fund, which comes from timber from tax-forfeited lands. $100,000 would come from the Consolidated Conservation Fund, which funds significant county investments. The last $200,000 would come from a small property tax levy increase over four years. Our board is really sensitive to any increases in levy. This is a tough county to raise money in because such a huge part of the county is exempt from taxes. So the board is really very sensitive about that. Should the home receive the necessary funding, the building would be located behind the North Country Park near the Sanford Health Main Clinic. The property was donated by Sanford and donated blueprints have also been drafted. Nearly a decade after the home was proposed, the project has recently gained momentum and has the support of local legislators Matt Bliss and Matt Grossel. I was excited for the fact that it was shows our uh, support of veterans and not just give uh, a voice to it, but to also say we'll, we will put our money where our mouth is. The unanimous decision to approve the funding was made last night during the county board meeting. The county has now reached out to 16 counties and four tribal nations to make financial commitments as well. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.